Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I appreciate you stopping by. Um, today, I am going to be painting my stock 16-inch ugly Cadillac wheels. I'm going to be painting them black, but not just any black. We're doing them truck bed coating black. Now, you might think that might look like crap, but really it doesn't look too bad. I do plan on murdering out the whole car, and if you don't know what that means... It means the whole thing's going to be blacked out. So there really won't be anything that is not black on the car when I'm done. So uh, I don't plan on keeping these wheels for very long. But they do need to get me through until I find something else. And I just don't like the look of these. So I'm going to show you how I prep and paint these wheels. So I have a nice durable black coating to get me through this Indiana winter. Alright, I'm back. So, I want to take a real quick second and say thank you to all my subscribers. If you have not subscribed, go ahead and pause now and go down and hit the subscribe button if you would and hit the bell icon so that you will receive all new videos so you can kind of keep up and maybe you might learn something or maybe you know a hell of a lot more than I do and that's really 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 possible so if you would please comment good or bad I'm a big boy I can take it and let me know at the end of the video what you think so to get started I am going to need to clean this wheel up because it's dirty and nasty and uh, paint won't stick to it so I'm gonna go ahead and use some soapy water and we're gonna clean it up and I'll be back all right well I've got this all prepped I've got it sanded degreased cleaned and tack clothed and now it's time for some truck bed coating and introducing the nozzle cam oh yeah check this out And this exciting. Hope if I move some shit around in here. Okay. That's gonna be good for the first coat. Yeah, check that out. Darth Vader style, yo. And coat number two. Ah. This will be fun. You're about to go upside down because the can is now not wanting to spray. Now you're back upright. Hope you don't get sick. Okay. I have found with this stuff that if you keep on spraying it works good if you let it sit for more than a few minutes then you're pretty much spraying upside down so keep that in mind hope you can spray upside down so basically we're gonna let that dry and uh, 
I've already got the lug nuts sprayed black with nope not rust all in but some old dollar Walmart black spray paint I bought about 15 cans of it one time I don't know why I just decided I was gonna do something with 15 cans of black spray paint and haven't ever touched it so there we have it now I'm now I'm using it so I'm gonna throw another coat of this and yeah, we'll just do that while we're here these don't have to be perfect they just need to be black they're lug nuts you're only gonna see the tip okay well I figured I better get a picture of these on the car before the light completely goes away because it's getting kind of dark out so I'm still back into the car sitting up because I've got this side jacked up waiting to put that last wheel on it but I think they look pretty decent man I'm pretty happy with it I think it's gonna be a pretty good look get the wheels all cleaned up maybe even throw a little armor all on them and uh, so yeah I think it looks better it's gonna give it a little sportier look especially when I get this thing all blacked out windows tinted pretty happy so thanks again for watching uh, the next thing we do is we're gonna be taking uh, the grill off and we're gonna black out the grill and I've got some black chrome spray paint uh, that I want to try on this chrome piece here so I want to try that too so the next video will be that probably be next weekend so thank you again for watching and subscribing and leave me a comment please let me know what you're thinking if you've got suggestions on anything so if i'm doing something screwed up let me know uh, or if you just like what you see or if you, uh let me know but this is uh this is going to be kind of an ongoing project for a little while keep it from looking like a grandma car or grandpa car so uh i even have some lens tint I'm thinking about using on my rear brake lights. I guess that would be the only place you would have brake lights is in the rear, but you get what I'm saying. Mm, probably not going to do the headlights just because I need to see, but I think they will look good on the back. So let me know what you think. Leave me a comment, please. And uh, thank you once again for watching. And I hope you all subscribe and follow me in this journey thanks guys have a good one see you bye